animations. Animations are special visual effects that you add to text and different objects on a slide. Animation effects enhance the appearance of the slide in the presentation. Animated objects make a presentation more interesting and attractive. You can also use them to highlight the main points in your presentation. PowerPoint also has various options to set the order and timing of the animations to suit your needs. To add animations to your presentation, open the PowerPoint and follow the given steps. Step 1. Click on the text or image you wish to animate. Step 2. Click on Animations tab. Step 3. Click on More button in the animation group. A drop-down gallery opens with various animation effects. The animation effects in PowerPoint are divided into four categories. The categories are Entrance. This category has effects that control the entry of an object on the slide. Emphasis. The effects in this category are used to highlight key points or objects in a presentation. Exit. This category has effects that control the exit of an object from the slide. Motion paths. This effect is like emphasis effect, but the object moves within the slide along a path or a pattern, such as a circle or a square. Step 4. Choose the desired animation effect. You will observe that a number appears in a box before the selected text or object. To see a preview of the animation effect you have selected, follow the given step. Step 1. Click on Animations tab. Step 2. Select Preview tool in the Preview group. Timing. To add or modify timing of the animation effects, follow the given steps. Step 1. Click on the Animations tab. Step 2. Click on the Start drop-down list in Timing group and select any one of the given options. On click, the animation begins on mouse click. With Previous, the animation begins at the same time as the previous animation in the list. After Previous, animation begins immediately after the previous animation ends. Step 3. Enter the number of seconds that you want the animation to run in the duration box. Step 4. Click on Move Earlier or Move Later to change the order of animation. Animation Pane. To open Animation Pane, follow the given steps. Step 1. Click on Animations tab. Step 2. Click on Animation Pane in Advanced Animation Group. A task pane opens on the right side of the window. The pane shows the number of text or object with the applied animation effects. In this pane, you can reorder the animations, change the timing, start options and the duration by clicking on the down arrow of each applied animation effect. Removing an animation to remove an animation, click on the number to remove. The number box gets highlighted. Press the delete key. You can also remove an animation effect from the animation pane. Just click on an effect and press the delete key. The animation effect is removed. Slide transitions. When you watch an animated film, the scenes keep coming one after the other. There is no gap in between two scenes. You can achieve a similar effect in a PowerPoint presentation also. This effect can be achieved by slide transition. The way one slide follows the other on the screen in a presentation is called transition. To apply a transition, follow the given steps. Step 1. Select the slide from the slide navigation pane on which you want to apply the transition. Step 2. Click on Transitions tab. Step 3. Click on More button in the transition to this slide group. A drop-down gallery opens with the various transition effects options. 
PowerPoint has three categories of transition effects to choose from. They are subtle. These transition effects are very simple and basic. Exciting. These transition effects are more complex than subtle effects. This category has transitions which are strong. Dynamic content. These transition effects are strong which affect only the content such as text or images. If this slide and the previous slide have the same slide layout, dynamic transition moves only the placeholders. It does not move the slides. Step 4. Click a transition to apply to the selected slide. A preview of the transition effect appears in the slide area. Timing. To add or modify the timing of a transition, follow the given steps. Step 1. Click on Transition tab. Step 2. Click on Sound drop-down arrow in the timing group. Step 3. Select the sound you want to add to your transition. Enter the number of seconds that you want the animation to run in the duration box. Step 4. Click on Apply to All option if you want this transition effect for all slides. Step 5. In the Advanced Slide option, you can choose how to move to the next slide. On mouse click. If you choose this option, the next slide appears only when the user clicks the mouse or presses a key on the keyboard. After, this option is used to set the time to move to the next slide automatically after the given number of seconds.